Hi Sagittarius, how you guys doing? Welcome back to my channel, Yansa's Universe. It's me, Yansa. Sagittarius, this is going to be your um, messages from your ex reading, okay? We're going to see how they're feeling versus how they're acting towards you. Because how they feel and how they act towards you could be two different things. And they could be showing two different things, alright? Ancestors and spirit guides of love, light, health, and wealth. Take me as I go within the tarot and show me clear, honest messages for Sagittarius. Sun, moon, rising, Venus, and North Node. Give me clear, honest messages for Sagittarius from Sagittarius' ex. Messages from Sagittarius' ex, please. And it's on. No weapon that's for me to get you shall prosper. Show me clear on this messages as I go within the tarot. Return to sender any and all negativity. Protect me, protect my channel, protect my viewers, and protect the messages. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. There we go. Okay, you guys, I'm going to be pulling from a couple different decks. Majority all the decks that I've made. So let's see what is going on. I'm going to pull um, some messages to see how they're feeling versus how they're acting towards you like i said and then at the end i'm gonna pull some advice for you guys okay this is for sagittarius sun moon rising venus and north node ancestors give me messages for sagittarius from sagittarius's ex please messages from sagittarius's ex okay this person act like a bitch bro they were a bitch they were if you were wondering if they were a bitch, yes, they, yes, they were. They probably still are, actually. Um, not for all of you. Messages from Sagittarius' ex, please. Okay, for Sagittarius. Give me one more message. Thank you. Okay, at the bottom it says, this is your sign to leave him alone, sis. Okay, watch the Virgo reading. This is your sign. Hello, this is your sign, okay? Uh, Sagittarius, follow me on my social media. Like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment, book a personal reading with me, all that. You know what to do. Okay. <laughs> I almost forgot. Y'all know my shit. Y'all know my freight. Okay. These are messages from your person. This could be how you feel or how they feel. Okay? What they thought you were doing, what you thought they was doing. Y'all know how it is. Flip, pop, the rolls, reverse them bitches. Okay? Okay, we have multiple partners. This person had multiple partners in the past. They did. For those that resonate for, they did. Damn it. Not everybody has the same story. Just keep, just roll with it. Okay? Just, you know. Y'all like my background? <laughs> okay, I drunk text you on purpose. This person is drunk texting you on purpose. On purpose. Okay? They could be drunk texting multiple people. Okay? I don't know what this person got going on. False advertisement. Okay, this person was like, I'm ready for commitment. It's going to be me and you against the world. They lied. It's just like, man, somebody sold you an iPhone 6, but it was in an iPhone X case. How you going? It's had an iPhone X case. It looked great on paper, but when I opened it up on the inside, it was a weak-ass Android. The fuck? Look. <laughs> I'm not talking shit about Androids. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. Like, I'm just saying. Like, how you going to... How you going to have husband material on the outside when when, I, when we open you up and we get to know each other and things start happening? You a, you a little boy trapped in a man's body. Same with the women, okay? False advertisement, okay? Is it too late for us? Oh, my gosh. Everybody's getting this shit. Is it too late? Is it too late for us? And then Sagittarius looking around like, who the fuck is us? Like... <laughs> Who the fuck is us? Okay. Sorry, y'all. Trying to fix myself. I pretend to be mad at you when I know it's my fault. Aquarius had got this, okay? You could be dealing with an Aquarius. You could have Aquarius in your chart. There's some weird... I don't know what it is, but y'all know what I'm talking about. There's some weird link between Sagittarius and Aquarius. I don't know why. You wouldn't want me if you knew the truth. You wouldn't want them if you knew the truth. That's They pretend to be mad at you. That's why they pretend to be mad at you when they know they just got done doing some shit. Okay? You would not want them if you knew the truth. I'm just going to make you mad at me and just hide what I'm doing. Okay? I need to heal now. Feminine energy. Okay? The feminine energy says, I need to heal now. I'm done with your shit. I'm done. 
I'm taking responsibility for my actions. Okay, so someone is taking, this could even be, okay, if you are on the receiving end of getting done wrong, I'm taking responsibility for my actions because I allowed myself to stay in this for so long. I um, didn't pay attention to the red flags or shit like that. But it seems like you or this other person is taking responsibility for your actions now. Okay, I commend you. Okay, it makes me angry to see you on dating sites. How dare you try to move on without me? How you? How dare you try to leave? You cannot leave me. What do you think this is? You think you're just going to leave me and heal? What do you think this is? Okay. Or this could be that motherfucker who has multiple partners that you caught. You caught them red-handed. I see you on BLK. I see you on Tinder, motherfucker. I see you on POF. Or whatever I see you on I see you on Facebook dating you cheating ass bitch okay and, and that shit makes me angry to see you on these multiple sites you thought I wasn't gonna find out okay it don't have to be that dramatic I'm a Leo so I'm just giving y'all emphasis emphasis okay okay I guess so who's making inferences okay reading between the lines somebody is inspector gadget okay fuck y'all okay <laughs> I know what I need to do now I know what I need to do now, okay? I never loved anyone the way I loved you. Okay, I'm getting Pisces energy from this. Pisces. I never loved anyone the way I loved you. I feel Pisces from that, okay? So, this person never loved anyone the way they loved you, okay? Whatever may have happened, this person says, I know what I need to do now. But it makes me angry to see you on dating sites. Past, present, or future, it made them angry. It makes me angry. But I'm taking responsibility for my actions. The feminine says, the feminine energy says, I need to heal now. Maybe this is this man healing their feminine energy, being more vulnerable. I don't know. I'm not making excuses. I'm just trying to, you know, give y'all some, some flavor, okay? You wouldn't want me if you knew the truth, though. You wouldn't want this person if you knew the truth. That's why they pretend to be mad at you. Because they just got done doing some crazy ass stuff. I hear that there's a masculine who's with a woman and he's down low, Okay? false advertisement yeah this person could be pretending to be straight when they're not this does not have to resonate with everyone someone pretend to not have kids when they really do or somebody pretend to have everything all together when they sleep in their car or they live with their parents or whatever it is it don't have to be any monetary thing you just thought that you were going to get a solid stable person to ride or die and this person just gonna fall off you're not even riding or dying with me damn but excuse me this person wants to know is it too late for us because they're drunk texting you on purpose but there were multiple partners in the mix could have been past present or future okay we're gonna jump into your all signs portion i just want to shuffle with you guys okay i see aries at the bottom of the deck you have aries in your chart could have been dealing with an aries Give me messages for Sagittarius. Okay. I'm shuffling with y'all on camera. Okay. For Sagittarius. Give me messages for Sagittarius from Sagittarius' is X. Okay. I told you we're going to see how they feel versus how they're acting towards you and what they're doing. Okay. For Sagittarius, please. Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, and North Node. Remember to flip the rose and reverse them and only take what resonates, y'all. If a word or phrase resonates but the storyline don't, just take the word or phrase. If one part don't resonate, don't take that part. Take the other part that does resonate, okay? Only take what resonates, y'all. That's what I don't understand. People will thumbs down a video that's not for them. It's not for you. <laughs> y'all crazy. It don't matter, y'all. If you're dealing with this is the all signs portion. If you're dealing with an Aries, Aries said, I want to be more than friends. Aries said, I want to be your man. I want to be your man. Okay? Aries said, I want to be more than friends. Get me the fuck out the friend zone. I wonder if you're happy without me. Okay? If y'all are not together, they're wondering if you're happy without them. Aries said, Candy kisses. Okay? 
I hear lay down and let me cover you with all these kisses. That's Tammy Rivera. She says, so much on your mind, it weighs in your head, but baby, you're worry-free in this bed. Lay down, let me cover you with all these kisses, okay? How do they feel? How does Aries feel? Block communication, you block them. And you that, That's why they message you on fake accounts, unblock me. Get me out the friend zone. How they acting? How's Aries acting? You remind me of my ex. Okay, this Aries is reminding you of your ex. Maybe Aries said, the reason why I can't act right with you, Sagittarius, is because you remind me of my ex. And I just, maybe Aries friends on you because of this. Now they're wanting to be more than friends. And someone is wondering if you're happy without them. If you're dealing with the Taurus, Taurus said we will be together again. And I wish things could be different. So, okay, soon enough, I think Ari, uh, Taurus is going to reach out to you. If you're dealing with the Taurus, Taurus says, we will be together again. I'm just wish, I wish things could be different. Okay. I'll, I'm going to try to make things different so we can be together again. Okay. Taurus said flexible. Yeah, they're going to get flexible for you. Okay. Probably open up their schedule, but this Taurus is flexible. They probably do splits on the dick and all types of stuff. Okay. Uh, all right. How does Taurus feel? I use different methods to forget you. Right now that now that y'all are not together, they're doing anything to forget you. Okay, this is how they feel about you. Sagittarius is doing any and everything to try to forget me. But Sagittarius needs to understand. We will be together again. So, you know, just keep that in the back of your mind. How is Taurus acting? You remind me of the people or the person who've hurt me. Yeah, I said that. It's right here. I use different methods to forget you. Okay, you remind me. Of the people or the person who's hurt me. I wish things could be different. We will be together again though. They got some stuff going on. You remind me of the people who've hurt me. You remind me of the person who's hurt me. If you're dealing with the Gemini. Gemini says. I remember every detail of that day. And I wish I treated you better. That day. That, that last straw. I wish I treated you better. Because that day. I remember every detail of that day. I wish I treated you better. Okay, they want to give you a massage or a back rub. They love when they they love when they got a back rub or massage from you. You could pay for them or they give you back rubs and massages or they pay for you to get a back rub or massage. Um, Gemini feels like I knew I loved you when I first met you. This is how they feel. They knew they loved you when they first met you, but how are they acting like a Taurus? Okay, <laughs> okay, they could be acting very bullheaded and stubborn and just unmovable, unapproachable, and things like that. Okay, you could have met them during Taurus season. You or you or this Gemini can have Taurus in your chart. They could be a Gemini Taurus cuss. They you be prepared to hear from them during Taurus season if you haven't heard from them yet. Okay, Cancer says I regret lying to you. Cancer says we both know I'm not the one for you. I probably pretended to be. I probably pretended to be good for you and pretended to be the one for you, even though we both we we both we both knew I wasn't the one for you. I regret lying to you for that. I'm sorry. Yeah, they regret that. And then Cancer says, "How would you feel if I told you I think I'm in love?" They probably lied and said they weren't in love. This part, uh, Cancer could have probably been. With, Cancer could have probably been with someone or just broke up with someone. Or if y'all are just friends, I get that this is your guy and this is your guy friend who's in love with you. Or you're a girl and this is your girlfriend who's in love with you. It don't have to be. I'm just getting like, you know, those vibes. Okay, how would you feel if I told you I think I'm in love? How would you feel? Okay, that's a Rod Wave song. Okay, who the fuck is this? Is this Cancer? Cancer. I'm, I'm going to stick to it. It's Cancer. Cancer says, I'm planning a big surprise for you. Okay, that's how they feel. Oh, they're planning a big surprise. How? This is how they acted. Y'all saw me shuffle the cards. That says down low. I specifically told y'all, I'm getting those vibes. This is, if you're a guy, your guy friend is in love with you. If you're a girl, you're a girl. I said that, okay? Down low. This don't have to be y'all's story. This don't have to be y'all's story, y'all. Uh, who the fuck was that? That was cancer. I'm going to Leo. Leo says, I know I crossed the line with you. But Leo says, I want you. Leo probably pushed, 
push to push. Leo is very aggressive. Leo, like if Leo wants something, Leo is going to be very aggressive to get it. And they can come off very cocky and self-centered and superficial and just um, someone you wouldn't want to be around, honestly. Leos can be that way. I get that way. Like if I like someone, you know, it's I get like super, like, I, I hype myself up like, yes, I can get them. I'm, I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. You can't deny me. Fuck a no. I don't know what no means. If I want you, it's, everything is a go for me. And, you know, they can come off very, like, cocky or self-centered. And it's not that, for me, it's not that I mean to. It, for me, it's like I had to build up all the confidence I had to approach you. Because if I like you, I usually won't talk to you at all. That's just me. That's just me as a Leo. I'm not giving nobody no excuses, but Leo says, I know I crossed the line with you. Whatever line they crossed, they know that they did. They they do want you to know that they love you, though. So this could have been your mom or your brother or your sister, and they had to slap you back into reality. They probably, it, this is not your love. This could be your lover or a friend or family, whoever this Leo is. They crossed the line. And they brought up some traumatizing ass shit. And Leo does that. Leo will just, Leo will say something that you know, that Leo knows damn well they should not have said. Like, you know, why the fuck did you, I told you that out of confidence. Why would you bring that shit up? You know, I told, you know, this or that. And ugh, Leo loves you, okay? I think Le this, I don't know what the fuck Leo was doing. Okay, Leo said, I'm a virgin. Wow. Somebody crossed the line with this virgin. Okay. Who the fuck? You're a virgin. Leo's a virgin. Okay. Somebody could have crossed the line and been like, they're a virgin or some shit like that. Or they could have been like, no, nah, you can't fuck with them. Or I don't fucking know. All right. You don't have to take that part. Okay. How do Leo feel? They have anxiety and depression. They feel like you have anxiety or depression. How are they acting? This connection does not align with your morals or your values. So whatever it is that's going on, somebody is crossing the line and acting against their morals, acting against their values. So I don't know if there's an older man who's attracted to a younger woman or something like that, or an older woman attracted to a younger man. I don't know what type of morals or values is going on, but this connection does not align with it at all, okay? I'm not judging you. I'm just reading cards. If you're dealing with the Virgo... Virgo said, I look for you everywhere. So Virgo is looking for you in the daylight with a flashlight, okay? Virgo is, will find you. Virgo will find you, okay? Virgo says, my life is not together as it seems. My life is not as together as it seems. But Virgo says, I only want you, though. I only want you. I can't hear. Got those busters. Okay, Virgo says, I only want you. My life is not as together as it seems. I'm not going to focus on my life right now. I'm not worried about that shit. I'm looking for you first. I need to find you first, and then I'll get my life together. Because I only want you. I don't, I don't give a fuck about fixing my life. Okay. Virgo says, how Virgo feels? Burnout. Yeah, they, they burnt out. They got to fix themselves first. I feel like you know that. Like, <clears throat> you you told Virgo, like, you got you to gotta fix yourself first. Because you burnt out on this. And then Virgo burnt themselves out. How is Virgo acting? I can't leave my boyfriend or my hood slash husband. So, yeah. Virgo says, I can't leave my boyfriend. I can't leave my husband. This could be you, Sagittarius, telling Virgo that. This could be Virgo telling you that, Sagittarius. This part of the reading probably didn't resonate. Y'all take the shit that resonates. <sighs> You're dealing with the Libra. It says, I'm becoming a better person. Libra is becoming a better person. What the fuck am I watching? listen the ghostbusters okay libra says i'm becoming a better person and just being near you is intoxicating libra's trying to get that lust under control just being near you is intoxicating libra says eat it from the back pussy talk okay eat it from the back the fuck pussy talk How, you want to make this pussy talk eat it from the back then Okay, this is what you're saying. This is what they saying. I'm just saying. Libra said, how do they feel? I never meant to hurt you. That's how they feel. Libra says, I never meant to hurt you. I'm becoming a better person. It's just when I get around you, I can't control myself. Just being near you is intoxicating. Okay? How is Libra acting? They have low self-esteem. They have low self-esteem. So this Libra is probably promiscuous or something like that. They just have low self-esteem and it comes out in different, you know, ways. If you're dealing with a Scorpio... Scorpio says, I buried myself in work to forget you. If 
but I can't stop thinking about you. I'm trying to forget you. I'm doing everything I can to forget you. I'm working. I'm working 24 hour shifts at work to try to forget you. Okay. I'm working three days nonstop to try to forget you. I just cannot, I can't stop thinking about you. I try to bury myself in the work to forget you because I miss you so much. I miss you that much. I miss you that much. Okay. How do they feel? Will you give me another chance? Okay, how are they acting? How are they acting? This is your sign to leave her alone, little bro. This is your sign to leave her alone. Okay, maybe they're, maybe someone is getting signs to leave the other person alone. Take whatever resonates with you. Okay, who the fuck was that? That was Scorpio, wasn't it? Sagittarius. I'm not finna do it. I'm attracted. I'm so attracted to you. Sagittarius says, I am so attracted to you. I hear, I'm still in love. With you, boy, I'm still in love. With you, boy, <laughs> I'm so attracted to you. But I hide behind material things. I hide behind the clothes. I hide behind the jewelry. I hide behind my house. I hide behind the cars, okay? I hide behind the money. I'm attracted to you, though, okay? If you're dealing with another Sagittarius, Sagittarius says, I only want you. I don't want to sleep with anyone else. I'm saving myself for you. I'm, I'm still in love with you. I'm so attracted to you. I don't want to sleep with anybody else. I only want you. How do they feel? I drive past your house. Okay, they drive past your house. Yes, they do. You driving past their house. Both of y'all. This is Sagittarius dealing with another Sagittarius. Y'all both do it. Okay, how, how do they act? I confuse you for some... I confused you for someone else. So they com So there was someone who looked like you and they confused you for someone else or you... And this Sagittarius were talking and y'all were intimate together, having an intimate conversation or really being intimate. And they could have called out someone else's name. Um, they could have called you someone else's name. I hear Bree, Kiki, D. Okay, this person could have, I said, I confused you for someone else. Okay, that's what it's saying. It was Kiki, it was Nene, and now she y'all 23 and now, okay. It was Sonya, it was Tanya, it was Monique, okay? All right, uh, who the fuck, Capricorn? I knew exactly what I was doing. If you're dealing with the Capricorn, yes, they knew exactly what they was doing, and now they can feel you leaving them behind. You said to Capricorn, you done fucked up. You knew what you was doing, I know you knew what you was doing, okay? This Capricorn says, I feel you leaving me behind. Capricorn wants you to spit on their tip, though on my tip for a dollar that's what i heard spit on my tip for a dollar i don't know who why would y'all say that to me okay <laughs> okay capricorn wants to take you on a date this is how they feel capricorn feels like you're dating okay how they acting though i don't take responsibility for anything uh-uh that's how they acting i don't take responsibility for a damn thing you thought oh oh i just had a sharp Okay. Sorry, let me get off Capricorn, my bad. Okay. Who's after Capricorn? Aquarius. If you're dealing with an Aquarius, it says, I hope that you can forgive me one day. Aquarius said, I hope you can forgive me one day. You came closer than anyone. You came closer than anyone. I hope you can forgive me. I can't forget you. You came closer than anyone else did. And I just, I hope you can forgive me one day. That's what they said. Okay, Aquarius said, Pussy Monster, Cookie Monster. Okay, they love to eat pussy. Okay, you love eating pussy. All right. How do they feel? I feel bad, so I make you feel bad. Yeah. They feel bad, so they are making you feel bad. Or they feel like when you feel bad, you do things to try to make them feel bad, and it ain't even their fault. Okay? This is vice versa. I don't know what I'm watching, y'all. Okay, we have Aries. Did they acting like an Aries, a boss? They acting very controlling. If you're dealing with, I don't know what the fuck that was. I just had a sharp pain on my face. Okay. If you're dealing with the, <laughs> if you're dealing with the Pisces, Pisces says sometimes I stay awake thinking about you. Pisces says I wish I could share my good news with you. They stay awake thinking about how much they wish they could share their good news with you. Pisces says. Your love is all I need and your love is all I want. Okay, how do they feel? How does Pisces feel? 
I know we are meant to be together. Okay, Pisces says, I know we're meant to be together. I already knew that. Okay? I wish I could share my good news with you. I stay awake thinking about you. Okay? I know we're meant to be together. And I love your love is all I need. Your love is all I want. How is Pisces acting, though? Like an Aquarius. Okay? <laughs> They could be in a in Aquarius pie. You could have met them during the Aquarius season. If you're not in contact with them, expect them to be thinking about you or contacting you during Aquarius season. Now, you could have Aquarius in your chart, or they could just be acting like an Aquarius, a star seed. Aquarius Aquarius don't really take responsibility for shit either. And how Aquarius act, they probably stop talking to you with no warning. Okay, let me get y'all advice before I forget. Give me some advice for Sagittarius. Engagement. Okay, you hear the song? It says, you should let me love you. Okay? Um, today, I made the conscious choice to engage with the world in an active way. I'll take a new route and talk to strangers. I will smell flowers and pet dogs. And maybe walk around barefoot for a while if I'm not inside a 7-Eleven. At the very least, I'll have a day that's slightly more interesting than average. And at the most, I'll have a startling epiphany or make a friend who will change my life forever. No pressure. So engage in life. Do something new. Do something different. This is all I have for you, Sagittarius. I love you. Like, share, subscribe, leave me a comment. Tell me how this may have resonated. If it, doesn't, if it didn't resonate, I'll catch you guys next time. I love you. Bye-bye.